Elijah Craig, Toasted Rye. Just came out on the market in July of 2024. We're going to release our review right now to let you know what we think of this brand new bottle. Before we get into the review, the September fundraiser for the Exploring Whiskey channel, which is always to St. Jude. September is uh, Childhood Cancer Awareness Month, uh, and childhood cancer is the leading cause for death in children. And St. Jude does some uh, just amazing work. Uh, their number one rule is uh, you will not pay for any treatments at St. Jude. Uh, they do bill your insurance and things like that, but uh, for travel, for lodging, for food, they cover all of it. And it's through donations that that is covered. Uh, yeah, some of it is big corporate donations, but a lot of it comes down to individual donations. So down in the description, you'll see a link. If you click on that and make a donation, we will match anything up to $500 in the month of September. So this quickly multiplies and can really help a family get through one of the darkest times in their life. Uh, the main reason why we started this channel uh, was in honor of my son, Jason, uh, who passed away from osteosarcoma back in 2016. And we continue to do these charity fundraisers in his honor. And we do the channel, honestly, in his honor. So anything you could donate, we would greatly appreciate. Now, back to the review. Welcome back to Exploring Whiskey. Today we're doing the a new release, a newer release, the Elijah Craig Toasted Rye. Yes, this sir. is about as new as you can get. They just released this in July 2024. Bought it four, five hours ago. <laughs> so this is pretty... <laughs> Brand new, fresh, not a lot of reviews out there. So we're, right. we're kind of uh, on the, the, the cutting edge of this guy. Elijah Craig, uh, Heaven Hill, we, mm -hmm. we kind of know all that. Love it. Um, Love Father it. of Bourbon. Yes. Uh, Elijah. Yep. The fun part with this is, one, it is, it's obviously Heaven Hill's own own spirit. Mm -hmm. uh, they It's a barely rye. So it's 51% rye. It's like right there. 30, 40 30 something corn oh. and like 14 percent barley malt of barley. barley so it's it's a barely rye so that means it's it's gonna That's be a, a little sweeter yeah the That's way a i would like bill. this and then they're taking that <laughs> rye. and they're finishing it in a really special barrel Especially so toasted. it's toasted uh in a, a, like an extreme mm. way uh, what is it, Independent Barrel Company? I think it is, Independence. They're doing like a kind of a special way that they're doing it. They're capping it and they're accelerating it. But it's, it's the way it's toasted is totally different than they've ever done before. So they cap the ends? They cap one end and kind of like... I was going to say, how do you see before you mess up? Yeah. It, uh, and then I, it catches on fire and yeah. it's gone. So they're capping one <laughs> yeah. end, kind of, yeah. <laughs> uh, they're capping one end to do like something special there, but it is sl slightly What's charred. the heat uh, again. circulate? So Rather than blowing it, it out. It gets to count as a straight rye because it's only touched a brand, brand new, new barrel. Barrel, to barrel, charred barrel. So he he texts us. I I did just pick this up. I'll try not to crack it open. So instead, there should be a thumbs up. We're cracking for... it open <laughs> on the show just for y'all. For the willpower people. I'm. It's. I, I get new bottles. I yeah, bring them home. Cracked I crack, he gets I them. He sends us pictures, and it's like, when we drinking it? Come on down. Especially on Fridays. Right now. <laughs> That's what it's about, man. Open up your bottles and taste them and share them. We're going top label for this one. All right, Philip? No, I'm joking. <laughs> Aggressive. I don't know what I have to do tomorrow. I can look at my calendar. We can do that. We can decide that after the show. All right, so we've got... <laughs> It works 94 the proof. Same as the bourbon. Yep. I noticed. That's very yeah. cool. Mm -hmm. Same right. as the, the uh, toasted, toasted bourbon. bourbon. Yep. Um, and and that, that's the other thing. When the toasted bourbon came out, like that's kind of not an easy thing to find. Well, I've had, I think, two. Yeah. I recently got like, I it's like six months now. ago. It's everywhere now. Yeah, but everywhere. when it first came out, it was not you saw something. It, if you saw it, you bought it. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah absolutely. No doubt. No doubt. <laughs> the fact that this is findable within like two weeks of release is really kind of cool. Yeah, we are uh, in Tennessee, which, you know, as you do, if you don't know that. You do know. You do now. You do now. 
Not as strong of a vanilla toasty note. I get a lot of rye, though. I get yeah, more rye spice. more rye than... It's a new... You know, it's just, we just opened it, so... So it's a little neck pour, probably a little bit tight on the nose and, and all that kind the of stuff. The vanilla's faint. It's, 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 it's sitting high it's on still there. not 95.5. It's not no, all no. that crazy... There's just enough dill. there for you to, like, oh, it is a rye. It's a rye. It's rye. not, like, right. bam, it's Yeah, a I'm rye. not going to... No. Yeah, it's not a crazy... Crazy rye, and I'm like, I wouldn't even go. Oh, it smells like a high rye bourbon. Yeah. No, it doesn't no. do that. It smells like a rye. And some people are, you know, run away from toasted barrels just because of the the punch of the toast, the punch of vanilla. You don't get that. The very top of the nose is pretty nice. That there is a little bit of a toasty vanilla note there. You get that rye spice in the front. Then it kind of just gets a. Uh, There's that vanilla. Baking like a baking spice. But creamy. Man, my mouth is watering. Ooh. It's creamier than I would have expected for a 94. Front. Like, yeah, I, yeah. I wasn't expecting that much of an oily kind of, like, coating thing going on there. Look at that. Um, got some legs on it's there. Got some, yeah, it's got some nice oil. Ooh, the finish goes on for the a finish, bit, too. The finish is where I think the toasted mm. shows up. I, I get a little bit of a toasty oak, a toasty marshmallow. Yes. Uh, uh, yeah. You beat me to it, sir. <laughs> like, yeah, that's the vanilla right. that I get. It's more marshmallow. It's right when you pull that marshmallow out of the bag. And well, drop it. I see. Yeah. I'm gonna say it's it's when you put it in the fire, but it didn't turn black. Oh, I'm okay. thinking of like I'm, if you just I got it more basically ate the raw, like just out uh, of the bag. I got a little toasty. I get that. I, not the smell. I wish you not get the, the smell, smell, the taste. Like yeah. right when you put yeah. on your tongue. Yes. Yes. Okay, I get that. I but I I, I kind I of little, I get a little charry note to it. Oh, first drink, no complaints Mm-mm. at all. No, and this could slash should open up, like. Now it's got some air in it and all that. Like, yeah, I'm getting ooh. so much more vanilla on now on the front. The sweetness is there. I mean, the, it's a rye, but the toast is really coming through nicely. It really plays well together. Yeah, I was gonna say this. We're gonna. It really <laughs> plays. You're well right. Together. We're probably short to the t- poured to the top of the label on this guy. It's 94 proof, people. It's okay. We'll be okay. You know, all the little. The, yeah, spicy this is definitely tingle. the guy for the people that don't care for ryes. This is a, this this is a is, yeah. non-rye person rye. And the person that loves rye maybe go the other way. Yeah. They're just like, you know what? There's not enough rye spice. The pepper. Yeah, the pepper's too much. It's too much in your face. Or no, yeah. Or no, not enough. Not, 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 not enough. enough. For a guy yeah, who yeah. really, Sorry, that's really, really, loves really rye. likes rye, yeah. this is probably not going to flip right. their frog, as you would say. You take the sip. You get a little all the tingles from the rye notes and all that kind of stuff. And then it just kind of. Yeah, the sweetness, the the mouth wateringness. Wow. I don't even know. <laughs> My mouth has not stopped watering. That is. At some point, it usually really dries up, but no, this is not. And man, the <clears> proof <throat> is all over my mouth. It doesn't go for me. Right. I'm not getting. I was hugged. I was worried like this is going to uh, like dry up and make my tongue sort of numb. No, the proof is in your mouth, and it slowly works its way down. Yeah, wow. I'm, I don't get a big oak impact. Like for saying it's toasted, mm. you know, it's double barreled. It's not like a big barrel to- like oak impact. It's all the toasted, toasted, toasted notes, toasting, toasted, toast and toast, toast and. and. No, I notes. think this is super balanced between the rye, the barrel chars, and the toast notes. So, so the story that I did read, they did a press release, and that's basically the only information I can really find on this guy. Um, and the, yeah. uh, in the press release, they said something along the lines of when the very first time they put it together and presented it to the tasting panel, like they were like, oh, we're on to something. Like, <laughs> like oh, Do oh, okay, this is... This is uh, this is gonna work. So, uh, they they did more experimentation since then, and yeah, I, I kind of think it works. Okay. Where'd you find this? Sweeter. Uh, uh, should I say it out loud? Well, yeah, sure. R R and B. Yeah. And I bet if you go tomorrow, there'll be another one on, on the uh, the cart. We'll say. For a release that again. A few weeks old. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, even, I mean, uh, you know, 10, 15, 20 bucks over, over MSRP. That's not horrible. Once they get to full distribution, I'm sure, like, the price will creep back down. Yeah. But the fact that you're getting the first release yeah. of this, yeah, it's about the time that you, you might pay a little extra for this. But, yeah, 55 is MSRP. Oh, even sweeter knows. Yeah. Got yeah. it. 
More dessert. I was going to say, I have Still? I mean, still, there's a spice note there. I mean, like, it doesn't bit, yeah. bury it out, but... I'm getting more of that. So, on the write-up, I saw a little chocolate note, and I was getting none of that. You get a little cocoa on the nose? No. A little milk chocolate? No? Uh, no. Power. Slight power suggestion, yes. Uh, Slight. But not, not on my own. A little more baking spice up front. And oh, there's even more rye. Oh, yeah. yeah. Way more rye. Yeah, the, the baking spice rye notes kind of came forward. But it's just in the beginning, and then it starts to get all the sweet stuff. The mouth, to the mouth isn't pop. as creamy. Yeah. Nope. No, but I get barrel char a little bit. That, that, yep. that like, hard, I guess that ethanol in my mouth is now, like, this. I think it's barrel char. That's what I was explaining yeah. wrong earlier. Yeah. Now, now I'm getting just almost straight rye. No, I'm not. I'm not. I'm not there. I'm not to the point where it's like, oh, it's, it's not honey, but it's like I'm just straight rye. But it, there's more rye, more, no, yeah. more, more apparently wow. rye than the toast, the vanilla, the marshmallow notes. I'm gonna say it's what better without the, the water. Now? I'm getting so neat. much toasted marshmallow on the nose. Neat now. is it? I really liked neat. Yeah, yeah I got I one too. <laughs> I got like a butterscotch. Slightly charred marshmallow could be butterscotch. I mean, oh my goodness. That's like a candy, super sweetness. Mm-hmm. Oh. oh, I love it. Love it. Yeah. Very, very solid bottle. Um, at MSRP, uh, all day long. Oh, yep. Mm-hmm. Uh, yeah, $55 for that, all day long. Really kind of hope that they start to possibly release it as a barrel proof. Just leave it on the shelf next to your guys. Holy crap. Oh, wow. <laughs> that could be an amazing barrel proof. So barrel funny. proof, toasted rye, and toasted bourbon. Release both those <laughs> together. Yeah. Oh, man. You gotta so buy them and get. They gotta be sold together though. Two, three, seven. Uh, the two, three, seven, right? Seven fifties. Yeah. Seven fifties. Yeah. 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 Three seventy fives. Yep. Sorry. Are you listening? Three seventy fives. Two, three seventy fives. Two, three seventy fives. Yeah, yeah. It's that. A little, little set. I'm craving like the little nutty note. Sometimes you get on Elijah Craig's. Not getting that. I wish it was there. I mean, it's on the bourbon. Yeah. It's not on the. I don't think it's on the rye, but. That could be interesting. God, we put. You sprinkle a little. Just the normal, the regular Elijah Craig was my go-to for a while. Yeah. Very good bourbon. Yeah, you can't go wrong. I think this is a definite try. Yeah. I would say, uh, I mean, if you're a rye fan or a toasted fan, or one of each, buy it. Yeah. Check it out. Absolutely. Yeah. Even if you're not a huge rye person, uh, this is a really good rye. Uh, so th- this Without is, water. Without? Without the water. Without gonna... the water is fine, but... Without water was better. Yeah. Less rye. Less Much rye. more complex. Less rye. More. Yeah. There was more layers to it. The toasting yeah. came through it. The, the, a lot mm-hmm. of the, those kind of details came it's through it. It's only 94 so. proof. So, yeah. Right. You're going to. Yeah. The water uh, muted, uh, muted out some of those magic notes and kind of just made it a rye again. I think this. Boom. I yeah. think this is a buy all day long, especially at MSRP. You find yeah. that for 55. Nice score. Nice score. Yeah, great score. I may have to swim by tomorrow. Yeah, what time are you going? I might need to back up. <laughs> Hopefully this is going to be, man, I, yeah, I'm going to go to a couple places this weekend and see if it's popping up. Hopefully it is. If they got it, I got to imagine that Total Wine's going to have some, because they always get the barrel proof. They put it out. They put the sticker, limit one. Yeah, yeah. I got to imagine that this is going to be there. It's some point in the next week or so. Kudos. Great score. Yeah. Nice grab. Um, yeah. It just came Good out model. a couple of weeks ago and you were able to get one as soon as it hit the shelf. Yep. Very score. Solid. Awesome score. Uh, delicious. Me, personally, I prefer without the water. Great. Yeah. I just thought it was just... And I don't mind rice at all. <clears throat> but I just thought it... There's more to it. Had more nuance. We hope you enjoyed our review of the new Elijah Craig Toasted Rye. Uh, if you can definitely find it at MSRP or slightly above, it's definitely worth picking up a bottle. Uh, if, you, if you go to your buddy's house and he's got it, I would definitely ask for a pour or two. Yes. See how generous he is. This guy. <laughs> <laughs> yes. yeah, that. So, but as always, we hope you enjoyed the review. If you did, again, we're trying to continue to grow this channel, pick up a few more subscribers. So we'd encourage you to hit that like button at the bottom of the screen. Yeah, that helps with the algorithm, shares it around the, uh, the YouTube uh, interwebs, and you can subscribe. We put out reviews, cocktails, blinds, a whole bunch of crazy different things around whiskey because uh, honestly that's probably one of the 
things that I really love. <laughs> this was... <laughs> yep, yep. So... And these two guys next to you. <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah, what's your favorite toasted rye? I know I had that Nulu one that was a pretty, that was a pretty good rye, toasted rye as well. Have you had one that we haven't heard of? It was coming. And then right up here, if you're interested, the, I made the comment uh, about the uh, blind flight that we did with uh, Elijah Craig. So I'll, I'll put that, I'll link that up. So we, we blinded a lot of the different Elijah Craig barrel proofs. Uh, and a private so, barrel in there too. Um, yeah. And a private barrel threw that in there too. So we'll, I'm going I'm to link that there. Take a look at that and you can kind of see uh, our preference for how much we really do like what Elijah Craig does. So they yep. do good stuff. All right. Thanks for watching. See you on that guys. See you on the next, <laughs> next episode. episode. Wow. <laughs> anyway. Have another one. Yeah, right? Cheers. Cheers. <laughs>